If you were expecting Mazda's new CX-70 SUV to be bigger than the CX-50 and smaller than the CX-90, you're half right. Many assumed the CX-70 would be similar to the CX-60 available in other markets. However, the all-new CX-70 seems to be a two-row CX-90 with blacked-out trim. While this might initially disappoint some, the CX-70 could still be the big Mazda SUV that many have been waiting for. The CX-70 targets, those whose children have grown up and left home. These buyers may no longer need a seven-seater, but still enjoy the feel of a large SUV. Unlike the Honda Passport and VW Atlas Cross Sport, which have unique bodies compared to their seven-seat counterparts, Mazda hasn't invested in significant structural changes for the CX-70. The differentiation comes primarily from unique front and rear bumpers, smoked chrome accents, and blacked-out trim. Unfortunately, some of the trim, such as the black plastic door handles and side window surrounds, feels cheap and out of place. Once you step inside the CX-70, any initial disappointment fades away. The interior boasts the same layout as the CX-90, featuring a beautiful digital dash and a dial touchscreen infotainment system. The CX-70 offers nicer trim and color choices, including an attractive black and red combo. Without a third row, Cargo space is ample, and the split-fold back seat can be lowered at the touch of a button for even more room. A hidden storage well under the removable cargo floor provides additional space, though its position might be challenging for shorter people to reach. Mazda hasn't released detailed specifications yet, but officials mentioned that the CX-70 would come with either a 3.3-liter inline-six with a mild hybrid system or a four-cylinder-based plug-in hybrid. PHEV, powertrain featuring a 2.5-liter inline-4, an electric motor, and a 17.8 kWh battery. These powertrains are likely similar to those in the CX-90. We anticipate the 323 HP PHEV version to offer the best performance, as seen in the CX-90, which sprints from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 6.2 seconds. Selling what appears to be a CX-90 without a third row and with a blacked-out trim package as a different model may seem a bit odd. However, eliminating the third row could allow the vehicle's inherent strengths to shine. The CX-90 received criticism for not being as family-friendly as rivals like the Honda Pilot, Kia Telluride, and Hyundai Palisade. By dropping the third row, the CX-70 might appeal more to those who don't need extra seating.